Ready, amp repair guy dot com two zero three eight nine two four one one nine. So we have a Heathkit SB two twenty I worked on over a year ago. Customer had bought a set of new tubes from another company it was when uh, Pentel was out of stock for a little bit on three five hundreds, but they are on top of stock now. That's not an issue. Plus they put tubes aside for my customers. So. I did all the mods and everything to this, and I have potted his other tubes. They start pulling current, uh, mid, one of them mid 6,000, like 6,500 or so. The one, other one was like around 7 kV. So good China tubes should high pot to at least 8. Usually they high pot to like 10. That's between the anode and the grid. Grid and filament's a kilovolt. Um, I stop at a kilovolt. So he told me he would use it and I guess in idle he'd go from CW tune to SSB and he would hear a ding ding so most likely one of the tubes is arcing that when I test them it's with the filament cold so uh, the structure can move a little bit uh, you know the grid um, structure also so they're probably uh, the breakdown voltage rating was actually probably even less so at that point so I was looking it over, I put my tubes in here, tested it on 80, and no pinging, dinging. I mean, I looked over everything first, and it was fine. So I started looking at the air variable cap, and I did not notice it at first. But you, I did see these arc marks, but I did not look here at first. Look, he damaged it. So needs another air variable cap. I had put this in originally. And um, this one had a lot of work done to it. So I um, had a, a new band switch put in it also. So I'm going to go ahead and replace that and uh, retest it. So I'll see you in a bit. Stay tuned. Okay, so we're back with the completed amplifier. Almost forgot to take a final video. So replace the plate tune cap, air variable capacitor. Ended up replacing the load side too. Had some damage, so retested it on all bands. No more intermittent arcing. She is she's good to go. So if you need an amplifier repaired, feel free to give me a call. Phone number is 203-892-4119. Website's ampreparegy.com. Also harbachelectronics.com. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. 73.